you a serious question right off the bat. Has this ever happened to you? You've prepared a delicious home-style American-based meal for your family, like hot dogs or lasagna or hot dogs, and you go to that fridge and find you don't have any gravy. You have zero gravy to put on that beautiful dish. Aww. Now, you could just go ahead and eat that beautiful lasagna dry, but you're not from Kearney, Nebraska. You would never do that to yourself or your family. So you do what I do. You go out to a fancy restaurant. And how do you know which restaurant is fancy enough for you? You do what I do, and you call Byron Beck. Please welcome Byron Beck. Hi, Byron Beck. Hi, Beverly. Hi. How are you? Hi. I like when we do that. It's fun. It is fun. I want to ask you a question straight off the bat. Where should they go eat dinner if they are in Portland, Oregon? Well, sure. Uh, there's some wonderful restaurants. One of my favorites right now is Radar. Radar is on North Mississippi Street. Is he Street. the boy from MASH? No, it's a restaurant, and it's on North Mississippi Street. It's known for its French cuisine. They do wonderful little bites and big plates, too, but Ooh. they're really known for their, like, escargot, and that's snail. Oh, no! Yes. No! Yes! That's why you're the expert. Now I have a question. Okay. What are their nuggets like? What are their chicken nuggets like? Tell me, how good are they? I bet they're great. What's the take on chicken nuggets? I don't think they have chicken nuggets. Why? Why don't you think they do? Of course they do. It's a reputable restaurant open to the public. I don't think they have nuggets. I don't think so. Can you call and ask them? You want me to call them and ask them if they have chicken nuggets? Yes, I do. But you can do that later. But first, tell us, tell us about another restaurant we can go visit, Byron. Well, do you like Italian? Do I? Renata is this great restaurant in the inner southeast. It's really known for its really unusual takes on pasta and antipasta. And you mean like not pasta? <laughs> no, that's a, it's, it's kind of like charcuterie. <laughs> I don't know who she is. What would you like to tell us about next? Well, I like departure. Departure. Be Keep going, I can hear you, de sweetie. De de departure is this Little great. Water, hon. It's this great restaurant downtown on you know top of a hotel. It's Pan Asian. It, it's really wonderful. It has a. Um, It's known for its wonderful You know, I love departments food. of all kinds, and that sounds fun. I have a question. When you're eating chicken nuggets, what is your favorite sauce? Uh, I... Let me guess. Uh... Let me guess. Re, re, uh, I, let me guess. I'm gonna say... Sweet and sour. I knew it. I know all the time what the games are and how to play them. Byron, you look like a little hungry person. Can I offer you a piece of nugget to give to me? And I'll put this nugget inside you. Um, please don't make me do that. Where are they gonna go? Inside me, Byron. <laughs> Tell us about another restaurant. One more. Oh, okay, okay. Um, well, um, I really like Paley's Place. Sure. It's in Northwest Portland. Vitaly Paley is well known for this incredible restaurant all right. that all the famous people go to. No. Yes, uh, yes. Uh, like President Brad Paisley? Cl no. Uh, President Clinton? Keith Cl Urban? No. Uh, President Clinton? Brad Paisley? No. Uh, President Clinton's been in there, mm -hmm. and he we went in there one night, and it was the same night that Monica Lewinsky. <coughs> <coughs> Are you okay? <coughs> You're good. You're good. You're good. Are you good? Thank you, baby. Are you okay? We have time for one more restaurant suggestion. 
Well, uh, I, I really like this one place called the Country Cat. And they, they don't do a chicken nugget, but they do something that is like a chicken nugget. It's a chicken fried steak. It's a wonderful steak that's <coughs> prepared like, <coughs> like chicken, <coughs> but it's a steak. It's a, it's a wonderful. I have to stop you in good conscience right there. Because a chicken nugget and a chicken fried steak is two different beasts. And you've insulted me in my house by coming in here speaking this heresy. I'm going to pray to Jesus Christ for you. That is all the time we have for Taste the Bed. We want to thank our guest, Byron Beck. You can talk. They can't hear their credits. I'm going to fire that kid over there. He doesn't know. I'm going to fire him. I'm going to fire him on Christmas. Thank you, Fev. Thank you very Thank much. Thank you, sweetie. Yes. All right. We'll okay. see you later. Bye. Goodbye. Roscoe!